In this video, I am going to teach about Bayesian numeration. Uh, I think you have been always hearing the term Bayesian numeration, but maybe you don't know what does it mean. Now, I am going to start with the meaning of Bayesian numeration. What is Bayesian numeration? Simply, when we say Bayesian numeration is the system where numbers are written in groups of 10. Sometimes the term Bayesian numeration is also known as decimal system of numeration. According to Hindu Arabic number system, we have a total of 10 digits. These digits include 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. If we count all of these mentioned digits, you get a total of 10 digits. We say that numbers are represented by symbols called numerals, and a single symbol in a numeral is called a digit. Uh, let us see different examples concerned to the digits and numerals. For example, a number which is read as 125 uh, is a number which is composed of three digits. Now, within these three digits, the first is 1, the second is 2, and a third is 5. To compose a number which is read as 125, let us see a second example. In this example, we are given a number which is made up of five digits, read as 43,896. In this number, we are asked to rearrange the digits to get the smallest possible number and the biggest possible number. Now, let us start with the smallest possible number. To get the smallest possible number by rearranging the given digits, you have to start with the smallest digit to the largest digit. Now, after rearranging the, in this way, we get 34,689. As you can see, now 3 is the smallest and 9 is the biggest digit. So, you have to start with the smallest and uh, in order they are increased up to 9, which is the biggest digit. Uh, let us see the second part of this question. Uh, in the second part, we are asked to rearrange the digit to get the biggest possible number. To get the biggest possible number, uh, you have to start with the biggest digit to the smallest digit. Now, after rearranging them in this way, we get 98,643. Now you can find out we have these two different numbers whereby uh, the first number, we have rearranged the digits in such a way that we, st we started with the smallest digit to the largest digit, while in the second number, we, we started to, from the largest digit to the smallest digit. Uh, from these two examples, I hope you have understood well uh, the concept of best enumeration. And within this concept of best enumeration, it is where uh, you have uh, seen the 10 uh, digits according to the Hindu Arabic number system. And in this, you have also understood that uh, numbers are represented by using symbols known as numerals. And uh, I have told you that uh, within a numeral, a single uh, symbol is known as a digit. Thank you for attending today's session. I welcome you in the next sessions. Have a nice moment.